difference in Jesus Christ uh, this gospel reflection is based on last week's uh, Thursday's gospel because of certain reasons uh, uh, what happens in that gospel Christ was telling about uh, John the Baptist he was portraying about John the Baptist and uh, uh, when he was telling about uh, John the Baptist because before that what happened the disciples of John came and asked him uh, are, you, are you the one or should we wait for the another? So followed by that gospel, so John the Baptist, uh, about whom Christ began to tell the people. So whom do you go out to see or in the desert? Is it a reed or a something like that? You know, he was asking the disciples. And then he began to ask, explain to them about uh, John the Baptist, how he was the greatest among the men, men and women. So... When you look at uh, the life of John the Baptist, so he was very keen or very active in proclaiming Jesus Christ, uh, in preparing the way for Jesus Christ. So therefore, he was portrayed by Jesus Christ himself. And then while appreciating John the Baptist, appreciating John the Baptist, so the main quality, the John does not know only about God, but he also knew how to exercise, uh, you know, knowing God and following Him uh, closely and telling about God to other people. So, so we have knowledge of God. We have knowledge of God. So how far am I able to use that knowledge into my practice, into practice? So if, you know, like Pharisees and Sadducees, I just have the knowledge and thinking that I am the greatest person, so I know better than the other persons, so which means you don't have the knowledge of God. You don't feel the presence of God within you. You don't know about God, sure. So if a person knows about God, he knows to humble himself. Humble himself. So that is a uh, great criteria that God wants from each one of us. So humble acceptance and whatever God is trying to do. So that is what you know we have to fulfill in our day to day life, in our lives as well. So therefore dear friends, uh, what we have to do is that let us not only have the knowledge of God, but let us practice those knowledges into our day to day life. Thank you.